And speaking of family, I'm away from home right now for the holidays, but that doesn't mean I don't get to eat some of my favorite Thanksgiving dishes. Of course, I was craving some of my mom's homemade dishes. I hopped on a Zoom call with her to learn just how she makes my favorite, the cheesy potatoes. Check it out. I'd like to welcome my mom onto the show. I can't be with her for Thanksgiving, unfortunately. Hi, mom. How's it going? Hi, Austin. It's going just fabulous. <laughs> and we also have your help here. We can't forget that. We have Daddy Love hanging out right now. He's doing the camera work, so shout out, Dad. How's it going, Dad? Hey, Austin. Doing great. What you'll need for this cheesy goodness, a two-pound frozen bag of hash browns, two bags of shredded cheese, one teaspoon of salt, a dash of garlic salt, 16-ounce sour cream. Oops, there you go. One can of cream of chicken soup, one yellow onion, and one stick of butter. Well, the first thing you need to do is turn your oven on to 350. Ooh, that's a good call. All right. Okay. Ooh, boom. Next, combine the ingredients, starting with the soup. It's just one can, and then oh, we need... This is, um, mine is very creamy. It's hardly coming out here, Mom. Oh. You, you need a spoon there, pal. Yeah, you... All right. Spatula or something. Oh dear, we might have a problem. Next, add the sour cream. How much sour cream? Um, the whole container, 16 ounces. The whole container? Mm-hmm. No wonder I gained five pounds after eating Thanksgiving. <laughs> From there, just add the rest. A diced medium-sized yellow onion, salt, garlic salt, stick of melted butter, two packs of cheese. We never said that we had healthy Thanksgivings at the Love House. <laughs> no, <laughs> this, this is not the healthy <laughs> dish. And finally, frozen hash browns. Do a little bit at a time, hon. Otherwise, you <laughs> <laughs> now. <laughs> Too late. Oh. Let that bake for an hour and a half at 350. I think it looks pretty good. It looks great. Woo -hoo -hoo. I'm proud of you. There you go. Mine tastes oh, it's so good. I will say it's very good, but it's missing the secret ingredient, and it's made with love by you. So it's, it just tastes uh -huh. awesome. <laughs> Wish I could be there, sweetie, but glad we could do this together. I'll miss you. We love you. And, um, love you, too. I want to wish you a very happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Love you, sweetie. Oh, so much fun being able to do that with my mom. I had to kind of convince her a little bit to share that secret recipe, but she, she got she got going. But oh my gosh, I was blown. I've had this every year, and I've just never thought about it. Just like my mom makes it, you know. So mm -hmm. um, probably about ten thousand calories. So if you're on a diet, which I don't think necessarily exists on Thanksgiving, start the diet at, uh, tomorrow. Uh, there's like ten thousand calories in this thing. So uh, it's not for the faint of heart, but we'll have the whole recipe on our website, wkyc.com. But Danielle, super good. Yes, I love it. And I see you trying to get your brownie points with your mom trying to be the favorite son there. <laughs> I'm already the favorite son, Danielle. Don't worry about it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. What, what am I thinking? <laughs> <laughs>